GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we're here today doing the Alpha 9 exp No, it's it's actually stable, so they call it. Um, there's been a lot of debate about that, but... <laughs> yeah, uh, they did release a patch to fix a bunch of bugs. There's still a bunch of bugs, though, so... <clears throat> yeah uh but that's okay i'm still kind of considering it kind of like an experimental build <laughs> even though that it's on the stable branch <sighs> so today we 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 are going to spawn in our Level 5 HV starter container HV. <laughs> All it is is just a, a cargo van, really, with some turrets on it. I mean, that's basically all this thing is. <clears throat> but let's spawn it in anyway. So let's get a little closer here. We can reach down a bit here. No, nope, cage up. And there we go. So here we have it, our, our little cargo, it's more like a, I don't know, kind of reminds me of one of those, um, what do you call it, um, uh, minivan, like for, you know, like what a soccer mom would drive, <laughs> but with turrets on it, I don't, I don't, anyway, uh, it's going to actually do okay for us, though. So, first of all, we need to get it fueled up. <clears throat> so, we can do that through the Wi-Fi. You can see we have two signals again. Uh, we can go like this. We can select the starter. We can select the fuel. And then we can literally just pick up, you know, we'll uh, use those up first. Sure. And then... Oh, there's some more down here. That's funky. Okay. And a couple more tops it right up. Okay, so... We only have three fuel tanks on this, but that's okay. That's okay. It'll, it'll, it'll service us. Now, we also want to get all of our food into the fridge. We have two fridges on this thing. Let's make use of them pretty quick here. We have... What else do we have that's spoiling? We're about to spoil this stuff. So, um, I don't know why I keep walking around when I just got to hit F4. And then, I can go in there. Hmm, what else, what else, what else? Is that it for food? I thought we had a whole bunch more energy bars. I think they're in the base, aren't they? No? Are they in the one of the constructors then? Maybe this one? No. No? Okay. I guess we've been chowing down on them. Uh, okay. Really? I'm kind of surprised at that, actually. Okay, whatever. Um, that's fine. Nothing there. No food there. No food there. But we, what we do need to actually take, though, is let's... Put some of the fuel. So we have 16,125 liters. We could take it all, but then that only leaves us 12,000 liters. We don't need that much. We don't even need that much. We don't even need that much. Let's give ourselves. Five, five, we'll take five. <clears throat> oh, 
Okay, so... We still have these medical devices we could put down. How much do they weigh? Oh, they're heavy. They're heavy. We could put them down, though. I think we should, because then it'll give us... I don't think they need to be powered to function. I'm not sure about that, but let's test it out. Let's test it out. We'll just throw these in here really quick. Might as well. I mean, we, we've got them, right? Let's make use of them. Uh, how do we want to do this? Medical on this side, medical on that side, medical there, and then we'll do a... That's a... Indigestion food, poisons, into, yeah, that's the, that's a good one. Let's put it up on the wall. I'm going to spin it around. And then the other one is a smaller one. We can just put it on the ground. Let's, uh, or you know what, if we, if we put it on the, wall it'll probably be out of the way getting in and out when we have to clone every couple episodes right <laughs> okay so i think we can just use them see i'm not sure because i'm not damaged oh it it did the yeah it's it's doing the funky chicken so yeah i think it'll work now, is it actually also going to allow us to home spawn here? It looks like it. Good. Good. That's excellent. Okay. Um, well, we don't really have any ammo at all for this thing. So uh, what I was thinking of doing to show how cool the... how the connected inventory is nowadays uh what i want to you know what i don't need to walk around to everything anymore let's just let's just do it from here i can actually do it right from the cockpit let's let's jump in here we'll go into the wi-fi what i need to do is i just got to grab some some wood we'll put it into the ore and wood here uh, I don't need a lot. In fact, these plant fibers would be just plenty. Just plenty, because it's just ammo we're making. And then we don't need a lot here. Let's... That is... Oh, that's a hundred... So well, that's okay. Okay, let's we'll throw that in there. Um, oh, you know what? We we actually need to make a core. Let's take let's take like fifty of each ore with us. Fifty ingots. Close enough. Okay, so what we can do is we can go into the mobile constructor and let's make sure. So everything looks like it's already all grouped except for the hover boosters. I think we need to, to group, regroup everything. And let's do an engines group. Whoops. <sighs> okay. Engines. Gosh. I'm just failing all over the place here. Um, We're way over on our CPU. What? See, I'm now I'm not understanding this CPU thing because how can we be way over on our CPU? This is a peeny little 
crap box of an HV. So they're going to have to sort that out because that's an unrealistic thing. You can't even... <laughs> like, really? My little... My little starter vessel isn't, we're not even capable of making something this big. <laughs> okay. Well, hopefully they don't ever enable that. Um, okay. So let's quit laughing about stuff. And we need to make a core. So we also need to, let's turn that on. We can put everything into the engines group. That's an engine. You can see I have two thrusters in every direction, except for the rear, I have six. <laughs> so I can get up freaking hills, because this thing gets heavy. Or this thing is kind of heavy, actually. Um, so the hover engines, and then we've got the RCS. Okay, and that should be good for there. We also want to make a custom one for the, we'll just call them the miniguns. Yeah. Miniguns and we'll turn those on and we'll link our turrets to the miniguns. And then what we want to do is we want to get rid of the predator thing. We want to get rid of bases. Generator, thruster, warp drive, turret, turret mounted. Yeah, just in case a capital vessel. I, I'm, I'm not sure if we need any of these other ones. Drones, NPC drones and players. Now, I wish they would sub that out to, I wish they would break out just drones in its own category right here. And then, and then we could just do, you know, NPC faction, drone, and that's it. And then it would just shoot drones. I, I would love that. I would just freaking love that. Because that's really the only thing I even want my turrets for, for the most part. Um, okay. Yeah, that looks fine. So let's apply this to the group. So this should only shoot at hostile factions, right? Or will it shoot at unfriendly? I wish it would say, there's not any info to that. Okay, well, let's go with it. We'll go with it like that. Uh, the next thing we want to do is we actually want to get some stuff crafting. So we'll go into the constructor. We'll get it connected to the ore and wood because it's got the, the major volume to it. Um, and then I think we want to make a couple cores. Let's make a couple of cores, and then, and yeah, we'll just put them out, output to there, that's fine. And then, what we're going to do is we're going to make a bunch of 15 mil bullets, and we're going to make, I don't know, three, four, I think 5,000 if we can, I don't think we'll be able to. We're going to run out of iron. We'll run out of iron. So because we're going to run out of iron, let's add a little bit more. Let's add a little bit more. So we'll just throw that in there. Yeah. Okay. So let's see how it's doing here. Okay, well, it's already on to the ammo, so. No, not quite. It's not on the ammo. It's doing the core. Okay, so it's doing the other core. As soon as it's done that, I'm going to switch the in. I'm going to switch the 
output to the uh, ammo box. And then it'll automatically, as it makes the ammo, it'll just put it in the ammo box for us. It's super convenient. And then we don't have to worry about it. Over time, it'll just build up. Okay, so now we put this into the ammo and we're golden. It just starts filling up the ammo box now. How cool is that, eh? Okay, so we should grab something to eat, I guess, because it looks like we're getting a little bit hungry. We have two fridges. I'm not sure which one is which. Oh yeah, we can just do the, oh, what, what, three fridges? No, we don't have three fridges. I know we don't have three fridges. I don't know why it says we do. <laughs> Okay, and these fridges are turned on, aren't they? Three minutes left? Two minutes left? Oh crap, maybe not. Uh, let's go into them as a device. Active, yep. Active, yep. Yep, they're on. Okay, that's fine. It just, I was a little worried there for a second. Okay, it looks like we're ready to rock and roll. So, let's switch to our... So we've already got 700. We can we can load up our we can load that up. Okay. So this thing is more stable. It can hold more. Oh, we're gonna automatically disconnect, right? Did we have anything in our bar? I can't remember now. I don't think we did, did we? I don't think we had anything in our taskbar. So you know what we should do is we'll connect now to the HV Orin Wood. There we go. Why does it do that? That's a little annoying. <laughs> okay, so... It wants us to go to signal. So where is that signal? Right there. Well, that's one heck of a distance. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. The other thing too is we can loot stuff like that now. We can get those big giant thrusters one at a time. <laughs> Yeah, no, what I want to do next is we get to level 10. We need a little bit of sathium or some hardened steel plates. And we'll multi-tool this down and bring in the Alpha 9.0 32,000 storage unit whole mole that I built. It's based on the previous hole mole from my swamp start. Uh, it's got a little bit of armor on the front, but most of its body now is made out of cargo extension. And, and that's actually the only way I could uh, get it to have 32,000 storage units and still have its same shape that it had before and all the same amenities without the armor, of course. Okay, so we've got an iron deposit. Just got to be careful because we've got radar connection here. Another iron, okay. Okay, so it's radar to the west. That's not a big deal. So this too has the the motorcycle front end. It's a it's a tricycle style th uh, hover engines on it to create stability on okay I gotta be careful for more like zero axe and stuff I think now is my turrets gonna go create that's a base so it shouldn't start shooting at it right no it seems okay copper Iron, 
Oh, good. And we're not in anyone's zone. We can, we'll be able to come back here and dig all this up. Prometheum. That's okay. We've got a half stack of it, so... We're doing okay for fuel. I think copper is our only one that we really needed, but I want to go check out to see what we can get from these things. We'll see if we can loot them. This thing actually flies quite nice. It's, it's really smooth for a tiny little piece of crap. It's because it's got a tricycle suspension to it. Oh, and wham, hit a tree. That's okay, we can go like this and just take it with us. <laughs> Okay. So, lots of radar. And whoa, 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 whoa. Is that the drone base right there? You're kidding me, right? Ho, ho, ho. What? Come on. Oh, there's a drone right there. A bunch of drones. They're coming at me. What? What am I shooting? Oh, Xerox. Oh, crap. <laughs> They're coming at me. So is this guy. Holy crap. Okay, this is a hot zone. Was not expecting this. Was not expecting a, Z uh, a Xerox hot zone for the uh, Titans. Crap. I'm not sure if I can get to it. I mean, that's the drone base. Ah, in their freaking zone. Wow. That sucks. Yeah. Yeah, I know I'm hostile. I just killed a bunch. Okay. Uh, well, let's loot them and see what they got. Darn it. Darn it. I was really hoping to get to that tight. That would have been some really, really good loot. Uh, I, we might be able to sneak up to the side of it and that's about it. I don't think we're going to get uh, this quest done. I don't think we can get the quest chain done without making a SV and taking out the... Come on. Uh, we're full. Okay, well, why are we full? Oh, right, because nothing... You know why? Because these things weigh... That's a... There's 2,000 storage units right there for that 200... It's almost not worth picking them up anymore. Freaking ridiculous. They gotta fix that too, because that's ridiculous. That's insane. And that credit cards, that's like a. You're taking the whole freaking giant ATM, strapping it to your hip. Like, what the heck? Really? 630 storage units for those 63. Okay. Well, I'm gonna take them anyway, because I got the capacity on my on my um, HV. That's the only reason I can. Well, let's jump back in here. Okay, let's let's see if we can get an angle to get to. Maybe, maybe we can just... But then there's another base right there, too. Like, I'm not sure if we can get an angle on this thing. There's a base right there. And then, oh, and there's the next, the next one. Oh, yeah, so 
And then the back piece is like right beside it. Yeah, this is looking impossible. Or at least highly improbable. Okay, well let's let's see. Let's see how close we can get. Okay, so we we got some it it got close enough to do something. Let's see what happens as it upgrades. Lots of Xerox around here. Find the mid part. Yeah, I, this is uh, unfortunate. So unfortunate. We cannot continue on with this. I was really hoping to get some good loot. I was really hoping to get some good loot. Well, okay, so, I don't know. Can we, can we try and get at it from, we can't get to the mid part. That's impossible. That's impossible because we got to do those event log thing. Let's see if we can get to the back part at least and, and like loot it. We can get to the back part and loot it. At least, at least I'll be happy about that. We got to watch out for Xerox. They're sneaky too. They're like they hide like right over a hilltop. Wait, is that the back part right there? No, it's not. Is it? Is that the back part? Let's take a look. Let's jump in. What is it? Nope, not that one. Uh, this one? Yeah. We can zoom in. Yep. Look at that. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> what the heck? Uh, uh, I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten drones all flying around in the same spot. <laughs> Eleven. Here comes another one. Well, they haven't spotted me yet. Oh, come on. They, 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 really? What? 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 What are they thinking? There should have been a prevention. Prevent from spawning. X close to POI. Why didn't they have that in? Well, that makes it undoable. That's a another broken mission because this is imp implemented incorrectly. You can't you can't get to it. You can't do the mission. Ugh. Okay. So there's my rant. This is broken. Again, not ready for release. This should have all been tested, and it probably, you know, I, oh man, I, 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 I just can't believe it. I can't believe it. We can't do this. It's sad. It's sad. It really is sad. Huh. <sighs> Well, I mean, I can try sneaking down there and try and, I, I just don't think I can get up beside it because the drone base is right there. I definitely can't get to the mid part. Unfortunate. It's really unfortunate. And then all the zero. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at all that Xerox right there. So now it's starting to register on my map. Yeah. Okay. So we're out of here.
because we can't do it. Um, that's really unfortunate. That means there's a huge resource of of loot that is just not going to be available to us now until we get a SV up and going, and we can't even do the rest of the we can't even do the rest of the um, the mission. So, uh, that's really unfortunate. Let's take let's take a look at the at our PDA. Okay. So, find Titan mid part. We can we can just manually do it. Check energy curtain. Okay, let's. Let's just manually do this whole thing. I don't think we get any of this stuff for manually doing it, though. But, oh, maybe we did. Oh my goodness, really? That would have went into my... Oh, it did, but it... Did it actually give me a gun? Really? Oh, I can't tell until I jump out. Okay, let's, uh, we can complete that now. Find the answers. And okay. So there we go. Uh, that is done. That portion. So that, and oh, really? Did it give us a whole bunch of stuff too? Wow, so that's a bit of a, Okay, well, good. Because <laughs> I couldn't get to the freaking thing, so I guess good. What did it give us? Did it really give us all that stuff? So we could have just started it and then just went complete, 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 complete and get all, like, armor and laser rifle and laser cells and stuff. I, it shouldn't give it to you if you manually do it. it. Or if you don't let it automatically update, it should not give it to you in my opinion. But it seems to have, yep. Yep, look at that, light armor, pentaxid. Now it gave us guns though, I guess it put it in our toolbar. I can't see yet until I jump out. So, let's see that. <laughs> yeah, look at all the guns we got, holy crap. Huh. Oh well. I feel like I cheated a bit there. <laughs> Got a bunch of goodies. <sighs> that was anticlimactic. Now what? Let's take a look at the PDA. Solo missions. Ancient revelations. Um, so it doesn't send... So we don't go to the... Oh. Oh. Uh, when we current, when we entered orbit, okay. Da -da -da, let's go. Go to space. Huh. Okay. So it, the the whole, the whole radar station portion is completely removed. Oh my, maybe is that why they made it hard to get to the Titans? So that you have to take out the, and that you have to build an SV to go take out the Titans to finish that. And then you have the SV to go, oh my, I think I totally screwed that up then, right? I shouldn't have manually completed that. I should have went and made an SV like I was talking about. But the weird thing is, is, you'd want to go to space right away to get all the good loot, right? So, eh. Well, not necessarily. Well, I think that's what we're going to have to focus on next is getting the mats up. Oh, there's another. Wow, 
hell, these guys are worth some really good XP. with Polaris. Hey, wait, let's check our... There was lots of stuff happening there. I'm neutral with... I'm almost friendly with the Talon. And I'm honored. Woo! Don't know if you can get hired and honored. I don't think so. Okay, let's... Let's loot these guys really quick. Take a look in a sec what we got. I just want to get them looted. Oops. Although I'm probably going to be full and won't be able to pick up stuff because they're credit cards. Yeah, so let's put that on that stack. Ridiculous, eh? Credit cards weigh you down. Did you know that? <laughs> because they do. Credit cards do weigh you down. That's like, <laughs> it's kind of funny. It's ironic. <laughs> okay. Well, so we're almost, we're almost friendly with the Talon. If we kill some more Xerox, we'll be friendly with the Talon. So that's awesome. Then we can go mine in their ter territory too. Oh, whoa. Um... Floating dogs. What? 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 Oh no, it's a... It's a Ripper Dog NATO. Ripper Dog NATOs. No, kill them. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, this is... This is totally ready for release. This is totally a viable, stable branch. <laughs> really? Where did that come from? <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, I'm almost level 10. That's awesome. <laughs> Let's just... And right on, friendly with the... Uh... Uh-oh. No, we're not out of ammo. Okay, wow, that was... Uh... That was just truly bizarre. We had Ripper Dog Nados. Uh, that's a lot of bodies. Let's loot them. Before they disappear. Problem is, is their credit cards are going to screw us, right? Oh, let's eat some of that. 
No, we didn't find any. Okay, okay. Oops. What is happening in my drone? It keeps flipping up and down here. That's... Oh, he's already looted. Okay, so if, if they've already been looted, it just opens up the container. That's interesting. Does it? Yeah. Oh, hey, that's good to know. So... Okay, well, I think because we borked the, I think because I borked the, uh, the previous mission by manually completing it without actually thinking about it and realizing that maybe this is what they intended and they want people to build an SV to take out the, the drone base before heading to space. It makes sense, doesn't it? The only way to go complete the mission is by taking out the drone base and therefore, or at least taking out the, the, the uh, defenses on the drone base. Okay, guys. Well, I'm gonna leave it here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep farming these Xerox for a bit until I hit level 10, and then I'm gonna go mine uh, like crazy in the uh, in both the Polaris and um, oh, we can get all this stuff too. Excellent. But the closer ones over here. The Polaris, I can get those, and the Talon. We can get all those, all that copper. Oh, lovely, lovely. Okay, well, next episode, I should have, I'm not going to have what I need to be able to bring in, oh, you know what, we might be able to, we might be able to throw some of those giant uh, loot things we, there might be enough sathium in in them to uh, for me to bring in um, for me to bring in the HV the uh, the whole mole I think what we'll do is Instead of bringing in the whole mole right away, we'll get the SV doing, doing what it, whoa. Yeah, these Ripper Dog Nados. They're just trippy. Any more of them? Nope, lots of these guys though, good. They got a lot of health. The level ones go down pretty quick, but the level three ones, they don't. over there okay I want to loot I want to loot let me loot <laughs> oh, oh don't knock myself off geez I almost did that would have sucked although I do have a jetpack it's not that bad oh really darn it it's probably oh 
eight. Yeah, wow, that's like way too heavy. What's going on there? It's because of that. Because of that. You know what? I'm going to have to. I'm just going to have to uh, manually loot these guys and pick what I want. Because I think I'm leaving a bunch of stuff behind. Yeah. See, I want to take the good stuff. I mean, I might not even take the credit cards, but I'll take them separately so that I'm not filling up my inventory slot. Can we get them? Yeah. Bullets, nice. Got lots of bullets now. Okay. Well, I'm going to leave it off here. Uh, let's put stuff in the fridge. And next episode. Nice. We actually have a pretty decent supply of food now. Just from looting those guys. Next episode, I think we're going to start on the an SV. We're going to start on an SV. Um, I might be using some of the large... I might use like some of those large uh, items at the uh, ancient artifacts, though, to put into my blueprint, though, because I need, I need Sathium and Neodymium. For the uh, oh, I have those pulse. You know what? Those might be enough. Those are a restroom ask. Oh, I could actually. No, I'm way too low of a level. I couldn't even make ammo for them. So yeah, we we can only do the basic rockets at level ten. So next time, SV build. Till then, you guys have yourselves an awesome. Awesome day.